Hello guys, welcome to uh, this new video. This one is a requested question. Question number two from uh, paper May, June 2010, and that is um, a percentage question. Okay, so let's see what happens in this question. So Wasin owns a shop. The table shows the costs and the selling price of the three items on this shop. So we have trampoline, swing, and bicycle. That's the cost, and those are the selling prices. Now question number one, part A. Calculate his percentage profit when he sells the trampoline. So the trampoline is here. What is the profit? So percentage profit, you have to first find the profit, which is 66 minus 48. That will be your profit, which is 18. Divide by your initial amount, which is 48, that is your cost, times 100 for your percentage. That should be 37.5% for your profit. That is your part A. Now uh, for part B, Wasim makes a profit of 30% when he sells a swing. Okay, the swing. Calculate the cost X of the swing. Okay, so you have to understand that the initial price, we always say the initial price is 100%. So now if he makes a profit of 30%, it means that this price here is, so plus 30, that should be 130%. So we will do this by ratio. So basically what I mean is I know that 130% is equal to 19.5. But I want to find the value of 100%. That will be equal to 19.5 divided by 130 times 100. So let's see what do we have. Times 100. That should be 15. So your answer is x will be $15 for the swing. Now for part C, in a sale the selling price of the bicycle, so selling price here is 110, this price of the bicycle is reduced by 20%. So part 1, find the sale price of a bicycle. So if the price here is reduced by 20%, what is the new price? You have to find the reduction first which is 20% times 110, that is $22 of reduction. So initial price minus $22 for discount. So that should be $88. So that's the sale price of the bike after this 20% reduction. Now for part two, we have a Thursday special price, save 10% off the sale price. So sale price you just found out from part one, it is $88. So you can save 10% of that again. So let's see how much we have. So Jaspreet bought a bicycle on a Thursday. Calculate the difference between the amount Jaspreet paid and the cost price. So what is the difference? Let's see. So the amount he paid will be, so you have to find the new price again, 10% off of that, that should be. So let's find out. 10% of 88, that will be a discount again. So. The new price will be, that should be 88 minus 8.8. .8. That should be 79.2. That is the price that he bought the bicycle on Thursday. Now we have to find the difference between the amount he paid and the cost price. So we take this and find the cost price. Difference will be. So 82 minus answer, that should be 2.8. Okay, so your answer is 2.8 um, dollars. That is the difference between the cost and the sale price. So basically he's making a loss of 2.8 by selling this at this price, but he just wants to sell the product. Okay, so I hope that was somewhat helpful. And as always, thank you for watching. I will see you soon.